So we're now checking out Dialog Isolate, another new feature in RX6. All yours. This is another one that we didn't expect. It really came out of nowhere, and it's um, it's really based on their heavy machine learning again. Um, so it really starts to really intelligently identifies what is speech dialogue and what isn't, and then we can we can remove what isn't speech uh, to to isolate. So we have again we have an extreme example here. So by listening to this, you'll see that it. You probably think to yourself, we probably should have re-recorded this uh, on set, which, yeah. But um, if we can't, you know, sometimes we're in post-production and this is what we get to work with and we don't have the luxury of re-recording it. So we can, we can save it. Let's, uh, let's give it a listen. Yeah, I would say that's a pretty fair sort of analysis of the way I start with things. Like, I like to mess. So you can just hear that there's all kinds of noise, right? And you can spend a lot of time with all of the other modules, and we used to you know, use all of the spectral repair and clicks and all this stuff, go in and, and work, uh, but it's really labor intensive. Of course, getting in there, uh, find calm and, and, and isolating, taking your time to do it is, is, is a great way of doing it. But here we have, we can do it in a broad stroke, uh, and we can actually maybe even combine a couple of modules together here to get the job done. So let's bring up Dialog Isolate, and let's see what, uh, what it's going to do. Very basic interface. We have a gain slider for the dialogue. We have a gain slider for the noise. Uh, and then we have separation strength. Um, kind of like we were talking about this. Uh, it's kind of like a threshold between the noise and dialogue. So um, keeping everything as, um, let's go to default. So this is how the, the module opens. So this is, we, if we feel like it, we can reduce the dialogue. If, if we really felt like it, uh, and we can even bring up the noise and completely remove the dialogue uh, if, we, if that's what we needed to do. But for, for in this case here, we want to remove all the extra noise that's not dialogue. So we put the, keep the dialogue gain at maximum, and let's bring the noise gain to minimum. And we're going to explore the... Uh, so we'll bring the dialogue gain to the maximum and the noise gain to the minimum, and uh, we'll use the compare feature. Again, seeing as there's no preview, it's just process. So we want to, you know, if you want to quickly jump between different settings, compare is, is perfect for that. So we'll hit compare, and you see it loads these settings into the compare queue. And let's, again, just preview our original, see where we start from. Yeah, I would say that's a pretty fair sort of analysis of the way I start with. Noisy audio, lots of stuff going on. Now let's look at the with the noise at the minimum and the dialogue at maximum. Again, visually, we see right away what's, what's going to happen. We know we can expect what's going to happen. So let's preview that. Yeah, I would say that's a pretty fair sort of analysis of the way I start with things. Like, I like to... Pretty, pretty transparent. Really cool. Still a little few, a few clicks, right? Yeah, you're right. Right here in the beginning, we can still hear a few clicks. So this is where we could combine uh, a few of the modules together to get the job done. First, we need to process this. We like this setting. Let's process it. And it renders it into the file. And let's open the just a classic de-click, which is pretty much the same um, features as uh, our mouth de-click, but uh, more for just normal clicks. So. We'll output clicks only, and I'm just going to load a single band, keep it at the default for now, and just listen to the output clicks only, and we'll, uh, we'll preview that. So it looks like it's captured our, our noise. So uncheck always, and now process, and there are 19 clicks. So we back off. Let's listen to after the de-click now. Yeah, I would say that's a pretty fair sort of analysis of the way I start with things. Right. Not bad compared to the extremely noisy situation we had here in the beginning. Yeah, I would say that's a pretty fair sort of analysis of the way I start with things. And now we're down at this. Yeah, I would say that's a pretty fair sort of analysis of the way I start with things. Like, I like to... Not bad, eh? Really crazy. It's um, never ideal to fix it in the mix, but we can do so much with, uh, with RX. Yeah. Absolutely amazing. Well, that's for Dialog Isolate, and we'll keep going with uh, the next feature.